begin with bizarre scenes at a major Sydney hospital. Three baboons have now been captured after breaking free from a transport van and spending hours on the run. Reporter Amber Laidley is live at the Royal Prince Alfred. Amber, how did this happen? Well, and the escapees were three baboons, one male who is roughly 15 years old and his two wives. They were brought here to RPA from a colony in Western Sydney, which is used for medical research. But in this instance, the male was being brought here to have a vasectomy and his two wives simply came along for the ride to keep him happy. This story broke at about 5.30 this afternoon when callers to a talkback radio show here in Sydney started claiming baboons were on the loose here in Camperdown. And to be honest, a lot of people thought this was a hoax until these videos surfaced online of three baboons being chased by medical staff and bystanders through the hospital grounds. They were eventually cornered in a hospital car park and police rescue officers and animal experts from Taronga Zoo armed with protective gear and what looked like very large nets were eventually able to recapture them. He did not want that vasectomy. So what will happen now to these animals? Well, the baboons are now being held overnight. Unfortunately for that male, the vasectomy is going ahead. We're told it has been rescheduled for tomorrow. Baboons have been used as part of medical research here at RPA for some time, and that medical research colony in Western Sydney has existed for decades. But in this instance, after years of successful breeding, the male needed the vasectomy to continue living with his family, Ange. OK, thank you so much, Amber.